Okay, so hi guys, I'm here with Astro, the guy of Envious. So I'm sorry, Mike, I'm going to take, take you out a bit of the game because Envy is going to play the Grand Final. How do you feel right now? Oh, it's, uh, it's an amazing feeling. I mean, the only better feeling than it is right now is winning. So, you know, we've made it to the, to the final, and that's as best as you can do without being a champion. So I just really hope for the guys that they can win this one. Okay. So first, you are a guy behind the scene. So maybe can you talk us through, like, for the Vacam community, know who you are and how did you get to be the guy behind NBS? Sure, I'm the uh, majority owner of the team. Um, and I'm the active managing director or CEO of the team, so uh, I, I uh, run all the business operations of the team, but I'm also a very hands-on uh, owner, you know. I, I uh, bleed with the players, I train with the players in terms of uh, for boot camp and being on the ground with the players, uh, with them for every meal almost, and you know, just really spending time with the team. Um, it's a lot of focus for me, and I believe in being part of the team just like they are, and uh, so I do a lot of work with them, but although I'm not in a lot of interviews, I, I'm still with them all the time. So, if, if I'm correct, you are a next pro player, but you were playing off Call of Duty, right? Yes, I was an old Call of Duty uh, professional player. I played from 2005 to 2011, um, and I've just uh, stopped playing in 2011, and our Call of Duty fans of the team were amazing, and we needed to continue to grow the team for them, and someone needed to uh, work the business side of the team. So I uh, stopped playing and began my career as uh, the owner of the team at that point. And so, basically, what brought you to CS? I love the game. I play, you know, I'm, I'm a gamer myself. You know, I'm, I was a professional Call of Duty player, but uh, I, I just love CS, and uh, I play a lot, and I was playing and playing and playing, and I also love watching it. Uh, just like any other fan, I, I, I enjoy all the games and the matches, and uh, even the, the players on other teams. I'm a big fan of some players and other teams, and I just enjoy watching the game. It's, um, it's like my passion, you know, so um, aside from Call of Duty, a Counter-Strike is another game that I, got, I love, and I wanted, really wanted to support a team, and we managed to, to work with the players. And so, in la next question, obviously, why, why did you choose a French roster? Uh, I thought they were the best. <laughs> I, I thought they were uh, also amazing people. You know, uh, the original roster we had, uh, they were our first priority. You know, we, we, when we wanted to have a CS team, they were the, the team we, we wanted. And we originally didn't think we could uh, get them, but um, we just really... Uh, you know, gave them a good offer and, and also worked with LDLC to make a transfer. So, yeah, it was just, it was the dream team for me and we managed to do it. And now it's my job to uh, just always give them the, the best available uh, chance to win. So uh, that's what I try to do. So talking, talking about that, actually, uh, what is the status? Do you, did you find your gaming house down south in France or not yet? We found it now, finally. We've picked one and we're trying to close it um, in the first week of September. Yeah, as soon as the major is over, we're uh, trying to file the paperwork. So, so the team's going to train there, not live there, only training? Yeah, some of the players will live there um, part time, you know, um, but it will be a boot camp facility for the team. Uh, it's in Nice. Yep. All right. Do you, do you know already what's the next big event you're going to go to? Yeah, we are playing in uh, Dubai, I believe, is the next uh, event. ESL Dubai Pro League event uh, opener. So it's a very big event also. It's a big prize pool, uh, the same as the major. And it's in Dubai, so uh, yeah, it's the next uh, large event for us, for the team. And talking about this one, because we are in Cologne, um, are you happy with the, with the new team so far? Like the arrivals of uh, Apex and Kenyas? Yeah, it's, um, like I said, I'm really close with the players and for them to come to the team, I think uh, we've already, between me and Kenny and Dan, we've already developed a really good relationship Uh, immediately, you know, like we're there, I look at them now like little brothers, you know, and um, I love them already, you know, they've been a great addition and they're playing amazing, like really, Dan has been phenomenal uh, for us and so has Kenny, they've both topped uh, frag for us in many games already, we've only won, lost one map, I think, in two tournaments now, so, oh, three, two maps now after TSM, but uh, one to Mouse at IEM, one uh, to TSM, but They haven't lost a match uh, in, in a, on the big stage here, so yeah, I think for me they've been amazing to, to be a part of our
our team. I'm so happy to have them and support them. Well, I think we we already wrapped up the thing. I'm I'm gonna let you enjoy the show, and I hope your team wins. If you want to add something for the, the the camera, the sponsors, things like this. Yeah, uh, I have to say this uh, because I don't speak French yet. Yet I'm learning, uh, but I have to say thank you to the French fans because um, although you know I'm an American and our organization is American, uh, I still feel like the French have the best esports fans in the world. I mean, anytime we played Call of Duty in France, they were the best. And for me right now, I can see the support that they're giving us here is uh, is uh, amazing, and it means the most to the players to have the, their own country support the team. So I have to say thank you to them because without them, uh, the team would not have as much confidence. And uh, that's the first thing. Um, our sponsors: Astro Gaming, Monster Gaming, uh, Scuff Gaming, Games, and DX Racer. They've done so much for us, and I can't thank them enough. Um, yeah, and just uh, anyone out there supporting the team. Thank you to them also. Okay, so well, I'll thank you too, because for, for the interview first, and also because yeah, your support makes uh, French team at the top level, so it's awesome. Thank you, Mike. Uh, thank you guys too. Thank you.